In the last 10 years, Labor and the LNP took over $14 million in donations from mining corporations. So it's no surprise that Queensland has some of the lowest mining royalty rates in the world. Billions in profit have flowed offshore as the big parties let mining companies off the hook and wasted the boom of a lifetime. How many extra affordable homes, schools, hospitals, buses, trains and renewable energy projects could we have built if Labor and the LNP weren't in the pockets of mining billionaires? Well, we have a plan, and one that puts people ahead of billionaire mining corporations. We'll raise an extra $20 billion off coal and gas corporations over five years by increasing royalties to a fairer rate of 18.75%. We'll ban government subsidies to mining corporations, like that $253 million tax break to Adani, or the $9 billion in subsidies that Labor gave away last time they were in government, and we'll stop any expansion of coal and gas. Our plan means less dangerous coal and an extra $20 billion for Queenslanders. Labor and the LNP, more coal and an extra $20 billion for massive mining corporations. Every Queenslander has the right to live a comfortable and enjoyable life with access to quality education, a fulfilling job, healthcare and an affordable home. But if we want any of this, we need to get massive corporations to pay their fair share. The major parties are putting mining billionaires ahead of our future it's time we told them they don't represent us. It's time we created a better future.